What is up, everybody? I am in the parking lot of the Jiu-Jitsu Dojo. Class starts in about 45 minutes. Uh, my buddy RK, who's instructing class, said that they're going to start a little bit early and some people are going to roll. So I think it'll be good for me to just get in there and absorb the environment a little bit. And, uh, yeah, watch. Um, it's funny that nervousness and fear, I guess, can, can stop you from doing things that you want to do. So I've wanted to do jujitsu for a while and it's just like the unknown of it, um, that's causing me to be anxious. And so it's fun. It's just, it's good. It's good for me to have this experience and realize that you got to just push through these things and yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be good. And maybe this will be my new hobby that I love and am completely passionate about for the rest of my life. And it would be super funny to look back and be like, man, you almost didn't do this because you were a little bit anxious. So yeah, this shouldn't be a big deal. I did martial arts all as a kid growing up. So for some reason, I don't know. I think once you hit a certain age, you don't really try new things maybe. And so it's been a while since I've tried something new in a new environment. Um, so this will be really good. So I'm going to hop in here in a little bit to the jujitsu class with RK and it's going to be good. I've been thinking about this probably for years and just never pulled the trigger on it, but there's definitely a scarcity of time. RK is moving his family to Paraguay in April. So I was just going to wait until the new year to do it, but it's just like, if I do my first lesson now, I can start the new year without all of this fear and anxiety because I will have done it once and I will know what's going on. So the other thing about fear and anxiety and stuff like that is just like sitting and thinking about it too much. It's just not, it's not good at all. So you've just got to take action. So right before I left the house, I was stretching my back out a little bit. I feel, um, I feel like I might be getting sick. So, you know, the achy feeling and everything. Um, so I stretched my back out and just sitting there thinking about how anxious I felt about doing this new thing. And it was just like, you cannot sit and dwell on that thought. You've got to just take action. So if there's something new that you're facing or something that you're feeling anxious about, I just encourage you to just take action on it. Action is going to help you, um, get over that anxiety. And so I think that's a good, good thing that I'm learning that action beats anxiety. So, so that's really good. So hopefully I come out of this class uh, without any injuries or like a black eye or something. I have to preach this Sunday, so that would not be good at all. And then I'm going to be sitting on a plane as well. Um, yeah. So yeah, I think it's, I think it's going to be good. So I'll make sure to shoot a Facebook live afterward and let you know how it goes and comment. Let me know if you are a jujitsu practitioner. I know it's like all the rage seems like everywhere, but especially here in Hawaii. So, um, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes and I'll, uh, I'll keep you posted. So yeah, I cut my nails really good, both toe and fingernails. I heard that that's a jujitsu, uh, just courtesy since you're going to be rolling around <laughs> with people. Um, so that's, that's something good to, good to do and know. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. I think that's it. So I'm excited. Uh, also, yeah, Simon Sinek says that excitement and nervousness is the same emotion. It's just whether you tell yourself it's positive or negative. So really, I should just tell myself that I'm excited about this. So I'm excited about my first jujitsu class, um, even though I am really actually nervous about it. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, this is no big thing. It's been a while since I've participated in any kind of new thing like this, especially in a group setting. Uh, but it's going to be good. It's good to step out of your comfort zone. It's good to do hard things before you have to do hard things, if that makes sense. So I want to get good at, good at pushing through fear because there's, there may be a time where I have to push through fear and there's a lot on the line right now. There's nothing really on the line. So I've got to build up the push through fear muscle. So, all right, that's all I got. Merry Christmas guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll report in afterward and let you know how things went.